Hello there, this is Ethan, and this is a uh, another Minecraft building tutorial. This is the third Minecraft tutorial I'm making, and this one is going to be for this stone house. Um, not gonna lie, I'm not actually massively proud of this stone house, but I kind of like it, and, you know, it's not difficult to build, it's very cheap to build, you know, bar the bricks, but... Yeah, that's why I'm doing this, because it's a nice building that's cheap. On the inside, I've done a bit of designing for the interior. There's a, I mean, look, there's a bat and everything. Jesus Christ, I'm good at this stuff. Um, some fires. Um, chest space. You could hollow out some of this and make a bed or something. You can even put in a second floor. It's a very tall building. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to show you how to make this. Um, I'm going to show you in segments. I'm not going to show you how to build the entire thing because that would take absolutely forever and it'd be pointless. I've got most of the materials that you know you will need. Um, first, let's start off with the doorway. Um, just leave a two by two gap for obviously two doors, and then build this kind of shape, which is four, three, three, four in blocks perspective. Um, this is the layout you're going to want to have for the general house. For each, um, you need to have four pillars. Um, they need to be 10 blocks high, and then for every pillar you have 5 blocks, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then sort of an opening here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, then another pillar, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, opening, so you can get the idea of that. Um, for the front of the building I've got this kind of um, diamond pattern, or yeah you know, so I'm going to show you how to make that. Simply from here, just place a brick on the corner, like where there's, so here, and then place two bricks above and next to it, and keep doing that all the way up, so you get this kind of shape. And when you get to here, you just want to go all the way back down, and knock out the blocks that are in the middle, so you get gaps in the middle. Um, did I leave, I think I left the top one like that. Okay, I'm going to do the same on the other side. It's exactly the same. Like so, and then knock them out. So you end up with this pattern. Um, then what we're going to do is fill it in one block behind the stone bricks with smooth stone. And it doesn't matter if it sort of not massively tidy um, unless you're doing interior de decorating which you can decide on when you know you're doing the interior but generally as long as it covers up the gaps it doesn't matter really when in my opinion it doesn't matter it might matter to you but again it's just a tutorial on how to build the actual building you can do what you like in terms of personal decoration So yeah, from the other side, as you can see, it looks kind of textured, which looks nice. One thing I didn't get in my inventory ready, which I probably should have, was torches. Um, you can all do the same along the top, also. Like this. Okay, as you can see, it's very messy this side, but on this side it looks nice. Okay, the next thing you want to do is just sort of build this across. So, close it off. Also, if you want to, I did this for mine. Put a torch in these gaps. This also makes it look very nice at night time, um, as a, sort of the light will be glowing out of the front. Um, and you get, you're going to want to um, make this sort of bit at the top. For each of them, I've built them a bit too high, but so yeah, for each one, you just want to bring this all the way around. And then it reaches back to the top. So you get another you get a square at the top. That's kind of what I'm getting at. Um, this sets you up for building the roof, which you can do the sort of zigzaggy pattern. Again, first one I'm gonna show you is just build put three blocks. Um, next to each other, one in. And then you need to 
do it like this. So again, exactly the same as before. Just place one, then one above it and one to the side of it. You're going to want to do the same this side. Until you eventually get a meeting at the top. And then, like before, knock out the ones in the middle. Um, pretty sure I left those two. No, I didn't. I know I didn't. So, should look like that. And then again, you just fill in the blocks. Um, you could be a bit more creative and use a different material if you wanted. Um, I just built this entirely out of stone because I wanted this to be a building that not only looked kind of good, I mean I think it looks kind of good. I mean, I'm not, it's not my best building but I like it quite a lot. Um, but yeah, and it's not difficult to make. Getting the resources isn't something that takes a while. Like with some of the other buildings, like if you've watched the How to Build a Modern House, I built that entirely out of quartz effectively, so that would take longer than this. Um, so yeah, as you can see over here, the roof is kind of textured. Now I'm just going to texture this. Um, first I'll show you how to build this actually. So for this, you're going to want to build this up as if it was another doorway, only it needs to be like this. So three up and then diagonally. So it's a, Let's pretend this is a nether portal without those two corner bits. So there'll be three, gap. Two, gap, three. Then you're gonna get another just build it above it like that. So you go diagonally so it's almost zigzagging. And then all you do is build this up back to the top. Like that. And then it looks like this. And then lastly, um, just again one layer behind it, just cover it with um, smooth stone. I'm going to show you how to do it because you know how to do it, and that's what it'll look like in the end. I haven't put any torches on this side, just didn't bother. Um, and if we go back over here, um, and then I'll just show you quickly again. The roof has sort of, is sort of like bulging out towards the top, and there is a reason for this, which I'll show you. Um, what you're going to want to do is build. Um, a 1 by 2 block on top of each of the parts of this and jutting slightly outwards like this and you do it on the bit on the side as well so it's like that um, and what you can do to make building the roof a little bit easier is build it all the way across um, this is a drain on resources, so if this if you're doing it in creative, then I guess it's not an issue. If you're doing it in survival, then you just have to build the steps um, accordingly without messing it up. But it's always easier to place steps when you're placing them on top of something. So I'll just do that many, that's fine. Then um, with the steps, you're gonna want to place them across here like you would any other step designed roof. So yeah, all the way across. And you build it from side to side, so it does go all the way across to the other part of the roof. Right, so just pretend that's the entire way over. Then what you want to do is place one of these on the end of each step so that it's jutting out a tiny bit more. And um, I forgot to do this, but there'll also be steps on the very side bit here as well. like that. And then what you can do as well is, um, wait, what did I even do? I'm confused, I'm sorry. Okay, there we go. I don't know what I did. What you can do is build it another one down to give the uh, thing a bit more sort of structure. It looks more structured when you do it like this. Um, like that. So it looks like it has sort of a beam of support, and if you wanted to, you could even cover up underneath here so that the steps aren't showing. Which again makes it jut out more. Um, and once this has gone on the entire roof, it will look like this. So.
So yeah, um, not sure if there's any more techniques I actually need to show you. Um, the front of the house um, has the exact same design on the back of the house, only there won't be a doorway there. I'll show you that now. There we go. Also, these um, sort of blocks here are just to compensate for the fact that I put bookcases there. So they're not needed, it's up to you. And um, both sides are exactly the same. Obviously, you put doors in here. There's no windows on this house, which could be fixed. Um, in fact, I'll have a go at it now. If we just get some glass panes. This is, again, purely just to show you that everything that I build does have some variation, so you can build it how you want to build it. We could have tall, long windows on either side, like so. Although it doesn't look too bad on the inside, I'm not sure what it would do to the aesthetics on the outside. No, oh, so fast pain. Yeah, see, I'm not too keen on it, but again, like I said, it's completely up to you. You don't have to build it exactly as I do. I'm just showing you techniques on how you can build and ways that I like to build. And the techniques I've shown in this video are how I like to build with layering different types of material that look similar, like stone. Um, how I like to build roofs um, and wall patterns as well. So, yeah. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's not as long as some of the others, but this building is very simple to build once you know how to make it. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. hope it's been helpful. Um, please like and subscribe and check out any other videos. I love you all. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, please like and subscribe. Goodbye.